What's up guys, we are back with another video. Uh, today we're gonna check out um, episode two of Gintama, uh, part two of the first episode. I don't know, I don't know how it works. All right, I kinda, I, I enjoyed the first one. So we're checking out the second one, okay? If you guys haven't already, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button down there. I'd appreciate it. And let's get into it, shall we? Man, they're already battling. A former gangster? Why are they just constantly hating on this man's hair? It's beautiful. Oh, so they're under a sword ban. Oh, okay. All right. That makes sense. And he is still tied up to the tree. Why, why am I not surprised? Keen. Wait, why did Katakin let, oh, the, the client. Okay. Dude, she is just crushing that rice. Oh my God. She's crushing that rice. Oh, okay. He doesn't deserve it. Why not? Why, why is he under the table? What? You stalker? I mean, I, I, the, uh, all right, all right. That's that's a little okay. We we got to discuss this because Mans was under the table. All right, that's a little farther than just being a stalker. All right, that's <sighs> not to mention the fact that he like interjected it in a conversation while being under stealth. I okay. All, all right, all right, I, I all right. She crushed the whole thing of rice? Girl, slow down. That's a lot of red beans and rice. Oh, rice with azuki beans. Oh. How is he doing this when he doesn't have money? Hmm. He's not wrong. Man, man just spitting facts over here. Okay. You can't just run away from your excuses and go to the bar because they're still going to be there tomorrow. Okay.
Damn. Wait, why is he bring <laughs> Man, this is just got hold on. Hold on. <laughs> this man, hold on. This guy is telling a story at a bar. And he literally has the picture frame of it. I've never seen someone so prepared to tell their life story. Wow. <laughs> A letter. Aw. He wants her to come home? It's so sad. Damn, that, that, that kind of hits hard right there, you know, like he's, he's basically trying to get his house back so that, yeah, who's going to pay for all that? Uh, jobs Gein. Uh oh, and he's puking in the freaking. <laughs> literally tries to put up like a a strong face. Uh oh. Oh, he's letting let, gotta let loose now. You know. Oh, he's a sympathetic puker. That's the worst. That's the worst. I'm the same way. If someone else is going at it, I'm I, and I'm in the room and I hear it. Oh, no, 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 no. I hate it. Wait, Gein's that strong? Was that for like the sake of like comedy or is he really that strong? Man's just straight kicked that thing and just no fucks given. No way, no way. Oh, yep. Why are they eating? Oh my god, you don't do that. Don't just break into someone's house and take all their food. What are you doing? No. <laughs> Why? Wait a second. Who who has a, a a cage like this built around their 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 living room? Because just in case, you know, you have some house guests that you want to have over for dinner and you know, you want to you want to trap them while having dinner so they can't escape your delicious food. That's the way to do it right there. If
like if he if he was able to kick the gate on the house off that that quickly like what's Yes, they did come all the way for that. Yes. Flattened? What the f I thought we were in like feudal Japan and then there's cars and now apparently there's a freaking uh air helipad? I don't even know what the hell to even call that thing. Is that a helicopter? Is that an airplane? Like it's got air it's got freaking jets on it, but it's a car. <sighs> I'm getting like a Star Wars vibe from that, to be honest. And this dude's just chilling in a bush. Okay. I am... I am so confused. Well, I mean, they gotta finish eating before they break out, you know? You can't say no to free food. It's Katsura! Why do they- why- why doesn't he like Zura? I'm confused about that. With the small print. <laughs> They're going to have a raid in Edo? What? <laughs> really? Okay. That's a, that's that's some next level evil genius kind of shit right there. He's not wrong. They don't know where the point is. See you, Zura. <laughs> okay. Wow. Yeah, say it now. They don't have any time to lose. Come on. <laughs> the, <laughs> well, that was a giant waste of time. Just going in the wrong direction. Well done. Well done.
10 minutes to reach the target. Ooh, okay. This is some like next level evil genius stuff though. Like they're trying to set off an earthquake. Hmm. I really want to see the dude with like the little guitar, like break out some like badass like music. And it have like some kind of magic spell, but it's probably not going to happen. Okay, that's just wishful thinking. And there's Gein. <laughs> uh, oh my God. Just, he, can, he can do whatever he likes, but apparently the government people can't do anything, huh? Because that makes sense. Five minutes until we reach the target. All right, all right. How? How? Uh, no, no. Uh, what? But like, how? But like, how? 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 <laughs> she said this is too special for a two-part episode. How did they even have time to build that kind of a contraption? He looked really sick. I'm sorry, man just got a lightsaber? What? He's got a lightsaber? That's not even... Dude's got a wooden stick! He's got a motherfucking... Let's see how this goes. This has got to be... This, uh, what? All right. Uh huh. Ah, she's so cute.
stumbled. He hit his foot and still managed to knock the dude out. Hold on, I, I, and that, this is something I see every time. Every 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 villain in any any show, okay, does. Why are you gonna have a red button? May, may or may not, okay, set off a giant rocket, or some kind of craziness. Why 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 even have it? Why just 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 for the lulls? Huh? Why did it double the speed? So it was a trap. The red button was a trap. Oh God, I, don't, I, don't, I feel like this isn't gonna work. Nope, it did not work. Wow. That's one way to end it. Just poke it in the eye. And it self-destructs. That's quite convenient. Buy a car. Elizabeth, Elizabeth is a savage. Hey, look, it's the cat. They, he can do all of that, but yet he cannot stop. He cannot catch the cat to get paid. Okay. Wow. Oh, what a nice little bittersweet ending. To everyone at Odd Jobs Gein, I have my family back. Thanks a lot. Oh, oh man. That's so awesome. That's a nice a wholesome ending to this two two part episode here. Yeah, that was a very, very wholesome ending to that. Look at Look at this weird space dog, I, I, space dog cat. I don't know what the hell it is, but uh, wow. Okay. You know, I can see why some people wouldn't enjoy that episode. Cause I feel like there was a lot more going on than what I was able to pick up on. Um, Cause there, it seemed like there were a lot of like inside jokes that I just, I haven't experienced yet. So I don't know, but um, yeah, I, like I said, I, I want to thank you guys for watching. I appreciate you guys. If you guys haven't already, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button down there. I'd appreciate it. And I'll see you in the next one. Later.